Nothing happened. Oh no, did it not work? Hello everybody, my name is Eric. In today's video, we're gonna be building a new app using Lovable. We're gonna be using two of their new features, which is their cloud and their AI. I'm a big NBA fan. And I always wanted to see how I would look like inside an NBA game wearing my favorite team's jersey. And today, we're gonna to be doing just that. All right, let's cook. So right now, I'm at the Lovable website, and I'm gonna be dropping my prompt in here real quick. And again, if you are new to prompt engineering, you are just getting started and looking to build out an application, I highly, highly suggest checking out Blue Mint AI. This is gonna be your number one prompt builder when you are building out applications with these new AI tools. Just wanna let you know, here is the prompt that I currently have right now. Uh, this is going to be an MBA powered uh, image generator that we're gonna be using Google uh, Nano for. So we're gonna be building a MVP application here. We're gonna be trying to build a landing page, authentication page, a gener gener generative uh, page as well too, and a profile page for us to use. Within our stack, we're gonna be using Lovable Cloud and Lovable AI to kick it off. And only thing that we're gonna be doing different here today is that I'm gonna be setting a timer above me. Let's see if we can build this application under five minutes. And also using one prompt. You guys think we can do it? Let me know in the comments before we begin. Is it possible? Um, we'll just have to see. Uh, before we kick off and kick off this prompt, I wanna say thank you to our sponsors here today which is you guys that are watching. If you haven't done so already, give this video a thumbs up. Let me know in the comments if you do find this useful and I will put the prompt that I'm creating also here in the comments for you guys to use. All right, so we've got the prompt ready to go. Uh, I'm going to just uh, start it off and right when I do that, I'm gonna kick off the timer. So again, let's see if we can kick this off in five minutes. And what we're expecting is that when this starts, the prompting is going to begin. And once we see our main page, uh, I'll, I'll figure out where we're at with the timer and see if we can get underneath it. I don't know. I'm excited to see where we get it off. See if we can do it with one prompt and see it under five minutes. All right. We're going to start it off in, in five, four, three, two, and one. All right. Prompt is in. Timer has started. So here is our timer. All right. So we're kicking it off. It looks like. Lovable is now taking in our prompt, trying to do a little bit of thinking. See if you can go through the process. Boom, boom, boom. I'm going to en enable the cloud. Again, if you are new to Lovable's cloud feature, pretty much it allows you to manage the back end of the database. This is where you're gonna be able to see your data tables, uh, be able to adjust authentications, uh, look at users' emails that are signing up, look at some edge functions, and maybe, I think you can also look at, you, you can also look at, at your API keys as well through the cloud. So it's now doing its thing. It's now connecting the AI, which is good. Now it's gonna modify the database. So we're, we're about a minute in right now. This is gonna come down to the wire, if anything. It's creating the profile tables. Come on, level ball, I'm rooting for you guys. What's gonna be amazing here, if we can do this with one shot, and if we can do this under five minutes. And the goal is to do a minimal viable product. And the reason why we're picking Nano Banano right now is because Lovable is running a seven day challenge where Nano Banano right now is currently free. So I'm creating all my content around this right now to utilize all the free credits that I can. And if you are thinking about joining Lovable, I will put a referral link down there for you guys to start using if you guys are interested in getting into Lovable and to vibe coding. So as this is also cooking up, if you guys are interested in building uh, an application or you want me to build an application live, let me know. Is it Agentic AI? Do you want me to build an AI rag model? Do you want me to go through more in depth with our videos? Let me know how I can actually help you guys. So we just wait now. No, again, I'm an NBA fan and uh, I think the first team that I'm gonna pick is the Lakers. 
uh, put myself in a Laker outfit and see how I look like in it. What about you guys? What is your favorite NBA team that you guys would use this application for? Oh, we have two minutes and 30 seconds left. Time is ticking. Oh man, is it gonna, is this gonna work? Is this video gonna be trash? <laughs> we'll know here in a little bit. Be patient, be patient everybody. I'm actually gonna hit show all. Oh, it's got a lot of work to do. So it's created the buttons, the landing page, the authentication page, and the generator. Ooh, we got a minute and forty-five seconds left. It's got to. It's got to do some work now. The anticipation right now. We're getting under. Ooh. I'm just looking at this timer right now. Go, go, go. And I'm going to, to stop counting when we see that that landing page develop. Oh, we got less than almost less than 60 seconds left. All right, four minutes down. Oh, here we go. Put this right here. I got to see that that landing page. I gotta see that landing page up. 45 seconds left. Okay, 43. I saw, oh, let me, I saw 43 on the shot clock. All right, well, so we'll put the timer aside real quick. Transform into your favorite NBA star. Okay, okay, I mean, it's a minimal viable product, everybody. Um, let's just check out the cloud before I log in and see how it works. So here is the cloud databases are set up. I've got a profiles table. I've got a generations table. I got a storage MBA headshots. I got my function ready to go. So everything looks pretty good from the backend perspective. Um, let's actually see if we can log in real quick and see. If it works. Um, I need to create an account real quick. So I'm going to set sign up. Go in here and put, all right, so I've got my email in here. I've got my sign up. Okay, authentication works. That lets me know the backend is now configured. And now I need to select, upload a photo and select my team. All right, so let's select a photo real quick. All right, so here is our photo. Uh, the team we're gonna play for is the LA Lakers. And our number is going to be six, seven. All right. Let's see if it generates. All right, nothing happened. Oh no, did it not work? Oh. Oh, All right, I think I might hit it too many times. <laughs> hey, that's your boy. Oh man, I hit it a few times. All right, so I, I got a few, I got a few. I think I just hit generate one more time. I'm gonna select the different team and see how it works. So let's play for the Houston Rockets. All right, we're going to select generate. I'm just gonna hit it three times. It looks like there's some type of delay right now. I probably we probably need to put like a loader or something to kind of help it out. Um, so let's see how it looked like in a Houston Rockets outfit. <laughs> All right, uh, but do one more. Uh, let's do the Suns jersey real quick. I 
And then once I'm done with the Suns, I will pick the New York Knicks. All right, so the image generator works. We were able to do it with a one shot prompt. Let me actually go back to the sidebar so you guys see um, for we can confirm. Again, we've got our one shot in here on the left hand side. Uh, we did a confirmation of our cloud uh, and then we did an approval of our AI and then our database. So we kicked this off uh, and it started kicking it off at 9.52 p.m. And then our last one that it created, that was at 9.52. This was at 9.53. Wow. Um, pretty impressive. Pretty, pretty impressive. Uh, let's check out some of our images. What do you guys think? Is this me? It's not bad. It's not bad. Let me go over to profiles real quick and see what's happening here. Oh, look at that. I got my player's card. That is so cool. Thank you guys for checking out today's quick tutorial video. We did it. One prompt, build an entire app within five minutes. Now, again, these are minimal viable apps just to show you guys what you can build with AI and these new tools that are out there. We will be getting into more complex apps here in the future. Let me know if you guys are interested to seeing a little bit more in-depth videos. What do you guys want to see? Should we build an AI agent? Should we build an AI agentic rag flow? Let me know in the comments. And as always, stay creative, and I'll see you in the next video.